the speed of equilibration of relative humidity probes and leapfrogging are closely related topics when we're talking about relative humidity measurement. Earlier you saw how relative humidity testing in general is a very fast method for getting correct readings and finding out where you stand with a floor moisture situation. We also saw earlier that leapfrogging, in other words taking external sensors, and we know that the rapid RH doesn't fit into that category, cannot be just leapfrog quickly from sleeve to sleeve because that doesn't allow ample time for equilibration. But let's just talk about why the design of the rapid RH is really superior allowing for very fast equilibration faster than any other relative humidity testing method and this again applies to the leapfrogging problem. How rapid is rapid? The rapid RH will equilibrate faster than any other method because of again the design, the fact that it's down in the hole reading a very small equilibration pocket. For example, within 10 to 15 minutes and again you're either trending upward or downward depending on which way the relative humidity is going you are going to be very close to your final answer with the rapid RH. You can begin making business decisions very quickly. For example, if at the 10 minute mark you're reading 87 percent relative humidity and you know it's been ramping up from the, from the very onset, you can be pretty certain that at the 24 hour mark or even the 72 hour mark that reading is going to be pretty close to 90 percent, 91 percent relative humidity. You know that that slab is probably not ready for most floor coverings or coatings. This is much faster than any other relative humidity testing method. And, the, and again the beauty of it is once you have that equilibration with the rapid RH you don't have to wait because it's not an external probe going into a sleeve.